meteorologist Larry Mowry. Quick update here during the commercial break on the snow that's falling across North Texas. You can see the back edge of the snow now that we through parts of Parker County and Hood County. Still coming down here across Dallas and Tarrant County, and especially in Denton and Collin County, and points to the north and east. That's where the heaviest snow has fallen and continues to fall at this time. And even down towards Waxahachie, Corsicana, Cleburne, we've seen a dusting on the grassy areas in some cases an inch or two, even all the way down south towards Corsicana and down towards Hillsboro. We've got one of our storm changers out in the field right now along 380 just to the west of Greenville. Here's their video coming in live right now. He's along 380. He's reporting slushy and snow-covered roads. Uh, the, this is US 380 up there in, uh, in uh, just west of Greenville, and you can see there's grass, snow on the grass, and anywhere from two to three inches on the grass areas, and the roads are slush covered at this time thanks to the snow that's still coming down in that area. Our forecast here for the rest of the season calls for the snow to continue through about 4 or 5 o'clock in Dallas and Fort Worth, then more so to the north and east. Let me show you the new updated winter storm warning that's in effect for Collin County, Hunt County, and also Hopkins County and points to the north and east. In that area, we could see three to six inches of snow, lesser amounts obviously here in the Metroplex around dusting to an inch, maybe two inches in some spots, especially as you make your way into Dallas County and down into to Ellis County as well. I'll show you that close-up map of the snowfall forecast here for Dallas and Fort Worth, and you see a uh, dusting from Fort Worth West and an inch to maybe three inches across parts of Dallas County and off towards Kaufman County as well. We did get some reports of two inches down towards the uh, uh, course of Canada over in Kaufman County got a report of two inches of snow on the ground as well. Once this freezes tonight, big problems overnight tonight and for that morning commute. One of the latest coming up at 530 on CBS 11 News at 530.